Hello, who are you and where are you from? I'm Elena Mylander. I'm from Reno, Nevada. All right, and where are we now? We are in a UC, on technically UC Santa Barbara campus, so in Santa Barbara, California. Oh, fantastic, and uh, w you are a uh, PhD candidate. I'm a PhD student, yeah, in the Department of History. Fantastic. Um, so, uh, has the climate changed much since you were a kid? I, oh, I would say a little bit. I've noticed um, summers are, are hotter and uh, storms are more severe. It feels like since I was a kid, I'm a little bit older than your average PhD student, so I have a longer memory. <laughs> um, but yeah, I would say things have changed noticeably. And, um, and then on a scale of one to 10, 10 being the most concerned, how much do you think about climate uh, on your everyday, in your everyday life? I would say about an eight or a nine, actually. I'm really concerned about it. Um, I, it influences a lot of the decisions I make, um, short-term and long-term decisions, so. Like how? Um, things like changing my diet to be a more climate-friendly diet. Um, eating less meat. Eating less meat, yeah. Um, and then I have a young niece who's gonna turn three soon, and I'm very worried about um, what kind of future she's gonna live in. So. Wow, yeah. absolutely. And um, so then what about, uh, well also here mm -hmm. Santa Barbara uh, campus is where Earth Day started, I understand. And, yeah. And uh, we had a, and you're on the ocean, we had a pretty uh, eventful winter. Oh uh, yeah, is there, is so many there, storms. Is there mm -hmm. any like uh, local climate issues, uh, climate initiatives that we should know about or? I'm thinking there are uh, a lot of initiatives to um, protect especially the ocean here, um, sustainable fishing and um, re sort of I forget the word for it but fixing the sand where it washes away for instance um, erosion erosion issues especially um, we have the cliffs right over there and those are constantly eroding and that's a concern for um, animals and humans so and I mean humans are kind of animal but um, it's a concern for a lot of people because it affects the environment in um, a negative way when they erode too quickly um, so yeah there's a lot of protecting the coastline protecting the uh, oceans yeah and uh, lastly uh, what about the future are you an optimist or a pessimist and what can we do about it I would say I'm cautiously optimistic because I've seen so much activity from, for instance, the undergraduate students I teach. They seem to really care about uh, climate change. Um, they're very conscientious about some of the decisions they make. Um, I'm really impressed seeing all the advocacy that they do um, on a day-to-day -day basis. And I think as long as we carry that energy forward um, into the future that things are going to be, hopefully, trending in a better direction. Very good. Hey, thank you very much here on May the 2nd, 2023 on the campus of University of California, Santa Barbara. Thank you. Thank you so much.